Hello YouTube, TJ's Advocate here. I wanted to show off an app that just released on two days ago. What is that? 27th? Sorry, I am completely lost when it comes to days. Called IEMU Stop. It's from a good buddy of mine. Um, it is basically the best app for iOS 5 to iOS 8.0.2 for downloading and installing different emulators, screen recorders, BitTorrent clients, and other miscellaneous apps. I do not recommend the BitTorrent clients, obviously, as that's just what they are. BitTorrent, I don't recommend it. Um, but to each their own, so if you do that stuff, I'm not going to stop you. I just don't recommend it as myself. You can also install iOS 8.3 Beta 2. Now, let me know in the description, so that, or in the comments, if you're watching this on YouTube. If you're watching it elsewhere, go to YouTube. Let me know in the comments so I can add it to the description or annotations. Let me know if you can update, because I know it installs 8.3 Beta 2. However, I myself cannot test to make sure that it updates 100%, seeing as I am a developer and already have the latest public beta. As you can see at the bottom, 12F61 is the latest public, uh, the latest the latest developer build. There we go. Couldn't figure out how to say it. But um, we, I'm already on it, so I can't say 100% sure that it works. Um, if you're on 8. Point, or if you're on iOS 5 to iOS 8.0.2, however, you can install anything on here using the date trick. All of these apps are 100% working with the date trick. Anything with a blue bar, like you can see NDS for iOS here or up here Show TV, those can both be installed without the date trick on any device, including 8.1 to 8.3 Beta 4. They all work completely fine as long as they are meant for that firmware. To install this, I'll show you how to install apps then um, afterwards via, obviously not the date trick since I can't use the date trick. But to install IU Mustop to your device, just go ahead and type in that link that you can see up here in the URL bar. That's all you got to do. Type that in. It'll bring you to this page. You click install. It'll try to ask me to install the profile. I obviously already have the, the profile. Just click install, then install again, and it will install the app to your phone's home screen, which you can see. Oh, oh. didn't realize that would happen. So you just go ahead and install, install, install. And then after it installs the profile, it'll take you back here. Go to your home screen. Right here's the app. And you're good to go. Then to download anything without the date trick, which the date trick is in here. And it also tells you how to do it with a Joe. If you're a Joe broken on iOS 8.1 or iOS 8 to 8.1.2, anything 8.1.3 or 8.2 or any 8.3 beta do not have a jailbreak right now. So if you're on 8.0 to 8.1, that's how you do it that way. But for the devices, or for any app that is already signed, if you're on 8.1 or above, you just go ahead and install. You can, it'll tell you what it's installable on. Go ahead and install again, then just install one last time. Go to the home screen, and you will see it install right there on your device and it should open up flawlessly without having to do any form of day trick. If they do have any issues, you can always go ahead and... Uh, oh, you also have to hit trust. Sorry, forgot to mention that. You just trust the developer. I'm not going to allow it, but you do that, sign in, and it works flawlessly just how it should be. And there you go. That's pretty much all there is to show exactly with IU Moose Stop as of right now since I'm on 8.3 I can't show you everything but uh, it also has different icons so you can change the icons to the device so I'll show you how to do that real quick just hit install I always have issues with this section right here it takes a minute I think hm. there we go install install and it'll change the icon just by going through install, install, install. Obviously, there's a lot of install being done. But once you do all that, it will change the icon for you. And there you go. I have the different icon for IE Moostop. It also has different skins for GBA for iOS, which is really, really cool. Sorry, I went to the wrong tab. Down here at the bottom, you have all these different uh, skins that you can get. 
And I think it's one of the only ways to get skins right now because I think GBA skins, the website is down currently. I don't know what that's all about, but um, I'll try to keep you guys posted on that, uh, hopefully in the future via Twitter or something. You can also see here other people who were meant who some way, shape, or form have helped or partnered with um, IEMU Stop. And uh, obviously here's the actual About tab. Oh wait, I'm sorry, I was already in that. I'm just special. You can go ahead and go to the website or return. I'm just going to return for now. And that's pretty much all I have to show you guys. Hopefully you guys enjoy. Hopefully you guys check out IEMU Stop. I highly recommend it. It is definitely one of the best um, app stores essentially out there right now for emulators and it's a very good partner with iOS emus however iEMU stop seems to be it just feels smoother to me for some reason I think they're in the end made by the same people Ascent, uh, like the app is made by the same developer but they're two different people very good partners very good people love their apps um, 